Looks like it's gonna be another hot one, boys, but we have some new powder, new injector. Let's see what happens. Let's go. Today is going to be one of those experimental days. I do have my injector that came today. Molds that I ordered still haven't came, so we're going to see if the man crate injector, man crate, see if the man crate molds that we get will work with an injector. So we'll see if that works. We got some new powder, so we have a turquoise color, and we're going to use some purple flake. Have no idea what that's going to look like, but it's kind of what this channel is about. We're just kind of experiment with some colors, some different color flakes, and see what we can come up with. All right, I'm going to throw this in the microwave, get it up to 350, and we'll get started. All right, so our plastisol is up to temp. Like I said, this is going to be kind of a trial and error experiment kind of day. So if you like what you see, you can purchase these lures on 99strikes.com. But I have no idea, like I said, how much of this powder to put in. So this is, a, again, half a cup of plastisol. Let's open this up. Let's grab and just do like the tip of this. Like that much, maybe? Well, it didn't blow up, so that's good. All right, let's stir that up and see what happens. Let's see if we need to put more in or not. What do you guys think? You think purple flakes going to look good in this? We do have some bubbles, but actually I kind of like the color of that. Just kind of put it on there, see what it's going to look like. Yeah, did you hear that semi drive by? That's probably going to happen a lot in these videos. But, okay, let's go ahead, add some purple to that. That looks pretty good. Put just a couple drops of this in. Looks good, and this is just some fine purple flake. Purple and turquoise looks, so that looks like it's gonna look pretty good. I think we should use an injector for this. I have no idea what I'm doing, so this could be <laughs> Could be good or bad. Let's give it a try. No time. No time to start, I guess, like now. Should we see what temp this is? Two seventy. Let's go ahead. We'll put this back in the microwave just to get it a little warmer. See if we can get some bubbles out of it. And then we'll inject this guy and see what it looks like. All right, I guess let's suck it up and give it a try. All right, let's move over here. I don't know, maybe this will help it not get air bubbles in it. I guess we'll find out. Nope, looks like this may not work because we have some air bubbles in there. Let's go ahead and switch over to the plunger. Let's push that out. Well, it was worth a try, I guess. Let's see if we can salvage this guy. Oh, yeah, this will be fun. All right, let's put this down. We'll go to round two. While you guys are waiting on round two, don't forget to like and subscribe to the YouTube channel because I'm going to start giving away free lures with some of this leftover stuff that we have. So in the comments below, just, you know, put subscribe, I guess, so I can get a hold of you somehow. But yeah, make sure you like this video, subscribe to this YouTube channel, and some of this stuff that I have left over. We'll be making some lures maybe in the next video. and. We'll be giving, giving them away to the viewers, so thanks. 
Thanks for subscribing. If you guys want to know if that was pretty easy to clean out, I mean, it, it was. It just popped right out. This is one of the cheaper injectors I got off Amazon because some of the ones that I want to get are all sold out. So we'll see. We'll see how this does whenever the new molds come in. Still working. Well, oh, awesome. This is probably why it was $30. I guess we can at least take a look at it while it's in the mold. But it looks looks pretty good. I need to take the gloves off because it's hard for me to... can't really focus on the camera touching the screen. I think it almost needs some black flake, but that's just me. It's going to be a lot easier to look at outside the plastic. Well, it's still pretty hot, so I'll have to let it cool down for a little bit. I think I'm going to. We'll go ahead and put some black flake in there, put it back in the microwave, see what it looks like. I've noticed I say okay a lot right before I start, so try not to say that so much, but I mean, this is really fine black, so we're going to dump quite a bit of this in. Maybe that'll give it a little more texture. Okay. There, see, I even said okay. Let's, I need to find something to say. I guess I'm just not used to talking to myself all the time. Yeah, I think I like that a lot better with the black in it. Let's heat that up a little more and we should be good to go. Our round two is definitely ready to go. So let's just go ahead and open this up and I'm sure it's probably going to be not done, but it's time to move on. Yeah, that's a mess. Yeah, it's still pretty warm. All right, let's kind of take a look at this. So it looks pretty good. I'm glad I added the black into it. So this is just going to go right back into our plastisol and get melted back down, but let's go ahead and start number two and see what see what a finished one actually looks like since we kind of know what we're doing here i'm just going to cover it back up with some of the oil put our clamps on this is it if this is your first time watching this channel or these videos, these, not lures, but these molds I got came from Man Crate's fishing lure kit. You can go to mancrate.com. I believe they're sold out now, but maybe they'll be back in stock. All right, let's stir this up, get some of that flake mixed around, and then let's pour. A little more. That looks good. Get all the air bubbles out. Slowly press. Now we hold it and we will be back. I really don't show this part, but I'm just going to kind of throw that back in there, throw these back in there, maybe kind of tear them up if they're big. We'll probably just throw this back in the microwave for 30 seconds, see if it's melted. If not, put in there a little longer, and I guess there's gonna be another, another mold for us to pour. And if turquoise isn't your color, 
check that out. We have a lot of colors to make. So stay tuned because we have <laughs> that's some good stuff coming whenever those new molds come in. Well, a good thing I noticed, I started talking and this wasn't even recording yet, but I just opened up our mold. Looks like it's gonna be pretty good. I don't see any air bubbles in it. Let's tear some of this stuff off. But I'm liking the color of it. Let's see. Take that off. Let's see if we can get this to focus. Maybe. I'll definitely get a better picture of it, but that looks looks pretty good all right i'll make a couple more and i would say that was a success no air bubbles everything looks good yeah what do you guys think you like the black in it i probably really can't see it the black but I said if you like it if you want better pictures of it you can also head over to 99strikes.com i'll have a couple of these for sale there make sure you subscribe to our youtube channel because i am going to be giving away some actually free lures. I don't know if I've talked about that in this video or not, but some of the leftover stuff that we have like this, we'll just be mixing together, making some cool lures out of it, and I'll randomly be selecting some YouTube subscribers. So in the comments below, let me know you subscribed. And who knows, maybe I'll be contacting you somehow and we'll get you some free lures.